hey 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 y'all welcome back um to another video i just wanted to come on here with another um encouraging word and this one is going to be um geared towards um the single ladies all those um that are single and waiting um believe in god assist in your spouse i had an encounter this weekend um that kind of reminded me of ruth and i wanted um to share this uh story with you all and hopefully it will um, give you some type of encouragement so this weekend was um, memorial day weekend we had a long weekend i had time off from work so i wanted to try to get some work done in my yard which is one of my least favorite things to do like i needed to uh, pull the weeds out of my flower bed um and then i have two flower beds and it's just something i didn't want to do but i just went ahead and did it so i could stop thinking about it so I'm out there um, pulling the weeds out and um, so I'm working in the yard. Y'all know Ruth was out there working. She was, uh, you know, in the field working. So I'm in my yard working and this uh, guy was riding down my street and he um, he stopped me. He stopped me and was like, why your man not doing that out there in the yard helping you? I'm like, I haven't seen my husband yet. And he was like, what you say? And I repeated myself. And he was like, wait a minute, hold on, let me pull over. He was like, because I ain't never heard nobody say that before. So he pulled over and struck up a conversation with me. So we were just talking. And he, um, eventually at the end of the conversation, he had um, asked me out on a date. He wanted to take me um, to go get some Chinese food or whatever. So I just wanted um, to just let you all know that you don't have to be all, you know, dogged up or thinking you got to be on all these dating apps or you, you know, have to, you know, keep going to all these different stores and, you know, just doing stuff. Now, it's okay, you know, to put yourself out there. Um, but for those that are like introverted like me and I don't like going nowhere unless I'm going on vacation, I like to be at home. So he found me at home, not saying that he like that he is the one for me because I truly believe in my spirit that he's not the one um, that God has sent for me. But I still just wanted to tell this story to give you all some encouragement that you can be at home, you can be in your yard working and have someone um, just come up to you and just notice you for who you are. Now I was hot, sweaty. Um, just looking a hot mess because I'm out there, you know, tending to the yard. So, you know, I'm on my hands and knees. I'm out here working. Um, fingers and stuff all dirty. I had a handful of, of weeds when he even stopped me. And I was walking to go put the weeds in the pile. He's like, where are you going? I'm like, I got to go put the weed stuff down. And I um, started talking to him. So you can be doing just what you are doing every day. When it is your time to meet someone, God will send that person to you. Now, even though I'm not saying that this isn't... Um, the man for me it doesn't stop the fact that i was still out doing just something i do every day or you know something that you could be doing every day and have someone come up and walk up to you so you don't have to be all dressed and glammed and you know have a full face of makeup and all that other stuff um going on you can just be doing you so my prayer and my encouragement for all of you single women to keep doing you believe god for your spouse align yourself with his word ask god to send the person that he has for you and just ask god to just send him when you are ready thank you all so much for watching take care and god bless